I think for Brooklyn, they've been rolling along beautifully to start the season. They've got the media, their fans, and most importantly themselves believing this is going to be a special year. Well, you look at how they and he will punish an opponent for giving him that much room for mid-range. He'll hit that all day. Well, I think the time has passed when the Heat were kind of the, the villains of the NBA. It seemed like that role. Back to Anthony. Here's Smooth. They set the pick. Shot off the screen. And it's Miami with another. Wow, has he? Yeah, Steven, that's the top priority for any defense. You got to protect the paint. There's a minute left in the first quarter of the game. And it's Miami with another. Now defensively, nice low post presence, which always tends to help you on the rebounding battle. So it weighed on the bench. This is who Eric Spolson the switch here. Here's Smooth. He's covered by Watson. Here's Smooth. There's the three. And good on the basket. Book it. It's too late to get to him out there. Looking at the last game for the Brooklyn Nets, it was a loss to the Magic in Orlando. That was a shocker, guys, because uh, that had to be a tough one for them to swallow. They were supposed to win. Well, he leading by 11. And keeping us updated from the sideline, let's swing it over to Doris Burke for an update. Hi, Doris. Hi, guys. Smooth in their last game against the Spurs really lit it up. He ended with 28 points. And Overall, they've just been frigid from outside. I mean, they've got to find a way to get better shots. And they've got to make sure their best shooters are taking those shots. Otherwise, I don't know if they can turn it around. Here's Smooth. Knocks down the step back, Jay. Smooth's got 18 points in the game. For three, Williams cannot hit. Close game as we wrap up the second quarter. It's kind of sharp and snappy from where I'm standing. Uh, very simple with just the black and the white. So a Johnson sitting on the bench. Here's who Avery Johnson's going with. Darren Williams out there with Bogans. Puts up a three. Can't get it to go. Well, he'd go the other way with it. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. This is their second meeting of the year against this Nets team. And what caused them to lose that last matchup for the Heat as a video coordinator. So, quite a climb for Eric Spolster. Bosch, a screen on Williams. Here's Smooth. Shot's good. Smooth's got 20 shot is off. There's never been any question about Darren Williams' ability to score. How about last season with the Nets when he had 57 in a game, including 21 consecutive free throws? Well, that's a Nets franchise record, the 57 points in one game. Amazing. That's good. Smooth's got nine points. Here's Williams, and it's Williams again missing. The Heat with the lead. Here's Smooth, and that comes off the assist by... 15 points for Darren Williams. Well, it's been a tale of two halves, hasn't it, guys? After a terrible first half, he's really picking it up. Here's Smooth. Train for two points. Here's Williams. Another miss by Williams. He's laboring out there right now, guys. The shot has not been falling for him this quarter. That's a three. That bucket in in no time at all. And it's a six-point heat lead. He's putting on a commanding performance here. He's hit two three-pointers in each half now. Johnson kicks to Wallace. Gets it to go. I think he's done his part to try to keep him in this game. It's been a solid effort from him, guys. Here's Smooth. Fires for three. And that comes off the assist by Mario Chalmers. There's 21 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Smooth. Nails the triple. Yeah, that was you stepping up when it matters most. 16 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Wade against Johnson. Pass to Lopez. 
Back to Johnson. From downtown. Bullseye. Great action. Back-to-back three-pointers in either end. Sort of an anything you can do, I can do better situation going on right here, guys. And so it's Brooklyn who scrapes by with the win. And Clark, you know, it was quite...